Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you for a album review finally. And I know it's been a little bit since I made a video. This album review is for Metallica's self-titled album, The Black Album Review. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to and let you know my thoughts on this record. So let's dive into this review. Now this is their fifth studio album from the heavy metal thrash band and I really really dig this album it's really good sorry I kind of burped for a second I was eating and I just it just came out of nowhere <laughs> I'm sorry that you had to hear that and see that but yeah uh, this album's pretty awesome um, Enter Sandman's a great song. I think the only one that I had an issue with was Don't Tread On Me. Um, it's nothing terrible, it's just, it was one of the weaker songs on the album. But this album, the rest of it, is amazing. It definitely is going to get a good score at the end of this uh, review. Or towards the end of the review but for the most part sad but true is another one that I really enjoyed holier than thou was uh, very good but I love the unforgiven that's one of my favorite ones I just like towards the end of the chorus with the what I felt what I've known and it's James's voice is just so mellow at that part, and I really love that. And it's so great. Um, the guitars in it are great. Through this whole record, the guitars are very awesome. And the drum work in it is really good. It's like you can hear James's emotions pouring into these songs now. And it's breathtaking. It's something really good. I really love this album. Um, I'm definitely going to buy it again for sure. It does close out with a fast kind of song. And although it's... I really enjoyed it. I really did enjoy it. Is what I am was trying to say. But... <clears throat> Well, there's no but. It's just, I did enjoy it. I enjoyed the closing track, The Struggle Within. That was a really good one. Even though it closed out a little odd. But still did pretty good. Of Wolf and Man's another great song. There were a lot of singles for this album. I think there were five singles. Which is pretty hefty of... Metallica. I'm surprised they released five singles for this album. Uh, Enter Sandman's one. Sad But True is another one. The Unforgiven. Wherever I May Roam. And Nothing Else Matters. And Nothing Else Matters is another favorite of mine. It was in the Supernatural show. So that's how I know it from. Where I know it from. And I've heard it maybe before Supernatural. I'm not sure uh, when the Supernatural show with Jared Padalecki and Jensen Ackles, which that show was good, but I, I'm not here to talk about the Supernatural show because I could go on and on about what I think of it and you wouldn't like this stuff. I'll talk about it <laughs> that I'm going to say about it mostly. <laughs> But Through the Never is another great song. Uh, the God That Failed was pretty awesome. And My Friend of Misery was pretty lengthy. But still really good. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed these tracks. They were really good. Um... Sorry, I almost thought my mom was calling me at first, so I apologize for that. Um, 
Yeah, uh, this record, there's so much emotion in James's voice in this album, and he pours his heart and soul into this music, into this record, actually, and it's so great. This is probably my favorite Metallica album. I think the first four albums were really good along with this one i think master of puppets was a really good album but i think the best ones are kill em all ride the lightning and justice for all and this one for sure hopefully i'll be hearing some really good ones uh for tomorrow which i'll be reviewing load tomorrow and yeah um i really love this album James's voice in it's great, the drum work in it's good, the guitar work is awesome, and yeah, such a great album, and I'm glad I'm reviewing these albums, because they're so good. Uh, out of 10, I'm going to give this a 9.5 out of 10. This is a really awesome record. I really loved it, hands down. It's one of my favorite albums from Metallica, and probably number one favorite, uh, and they did a great job. I like the album picture, which is pretty cool, with the snake, and it's all black, but it's really hard to make out when it says Metallica on the left side of the corner, at the top left side of the corner of the album cover or whatever. Or the CD is what I'm trying to say, the CD cover. But, yeah, for the most part, this is a really good record. I recommend this to anyone that's new to Metallica. Uh, definitely check this out, for sure. Um, comment below. Let me know what you guys thought of the Metallica album, the Black Album. The self-titled album, if you've heard it. And if you like this album review, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel. Well guys, I'm actually almost to 200 subscribers now, which is really awesome. Uh, thank you guys for supporting me for these past two years. Or, uh, it's... Yeah, I started in 2018 and now in 2020 it's starting to climb i'm almost to the 200s now which i'm really excited because i will make a special video about 200 peak or whatever for it's a special video to thank you guys for subscribing and yeah um i will return to you tomorrow for metallica's load album review and then i'll do reload on tuesday then Death Magnetic's gonna be Saturday, unfortunately. I gotta put it off till May 2nd, which I actually might start working again pretty soon. I don't know for sure, but I'm gonna find out Wednesday from my boss, see what he says, cause I definitely do need to work again. Uh, cause it's, I've been without a job for almost over a month now. Or a month and a half. So it's been too long. <laughs> but anyways, uh, I hope you enjoyed this album review. I did the best I could to make it as good as possible. I hope you liked it. Uh, if you didn't, comment below and let me know what issues you had with this review. But if you did like it, then thanks for watching, for sure. I really appreciate it. Uh, the Hardwired to Self-Destruct album review is going to be next Sunday, so definitely stay tuned for that. That'll be the last Metallica album review I do. Only got maybe four more to do, because I already reviewed Saint Anger, and I did not like that record. But anyways, thank you for watching this album review. I look forward to doing more album reviews for you guys soon. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in my next video.